Hey everyone, this is Leska here, back to another FIFA 21 video for you guys today. And in this video, I'm going to be going over the fastest way to level up in Volta in this game. So, from my experience, I have been doing a lot of featured squad battles and just been grinding them and getting, the, getting through the games as fast as possible because if you get five goals in the feature battles, the game ends immediately. You basically just go to five and then it ends. So you can go through games really fast because it uh, only goes to five every single game unless you play the uh, game with Mbappe or the Liverpool game. That's timed and there's no limit. But let me just show you guys real quick um, just to prove that I have max skill points. The maximum amount of skill points is 75 in this game. So there you go at the top right, I have max skill point 75. Um, so let me just explain a little bit more what I've been doing. I have been going into featured battles, and as you can see, I won 5 1, 5 2, 5 0. Oh. Um, you can click on a game like this, and what I would do is put it all the way at beginner and then press play. And I'd play just as my avatar, or you can play as your team too if you'd want, if you want to just grind them. You can either grind these games like by actually playing them or what I did a lot is I just let Mbappe, who was on my team, and the other computer, Nelly, just 2v3 pretty much the other teams in 3v3 rush or even 4v4 rush. Those are the best ones because there's no goalie, so it's easiest to just score because um, there's no goalie in the goal. Um, so all you have to do is pretty much just let computer win for you or you can just grind them yourself and just steal the ball from computer on beginner, which is very easy to do. You can pretty much steal it from computer on the kickoff every time and then you can just score because there's no goalie and then you can just get five goals as fast as possible and then go on to the next game and just keep doing that very quickly and then after every single game you get one skill point except for the very last game I believe you get three skill points which I will show because I actually have recorded my last game of skill points that I got unlocked and it gave me three skill points so keep that in mind. Once you eventually see that you unlock three skill points after one game, that means you have max skill points. Um, so I'm going to be showing you guys the gameplay of this on the screen just to show you guys a little bit more so you can see what I'm really talking about. Alright guys, so in this little feature battle, this is what I'm talking about. Um, it's a 3v3 rush and I have Mbappe and Nelly on my team. I just started recording after we already went up 2-0 because it was pretty amazing because I'm not even touching my controller and I'm just glancing at my monitor every so often and seeing what's happened. I'm not really, I'm really just not paying attention to the game and not even touching my stick at all. And Mbappe and Nelly just 2v3 them and eventually 5-0 them without me even having to touch the controller. Um, so that's definitely the one way you can get leveled up is just letting your computer just dominate but it might also have a little bit of effect because I do have Mbappe and also 92 rated Nelly just 2v3 in people so if you are new to Volta it might be a little bit more difficult but then again you can just grind it yourself you don't have to let just computer win you can literally just play on beginner steal the ball from beginner on kickoff pretty much every single time and just score because it's 3v3 rush 4v4 rush I would definitely recommend doing those you could if you don't even have a 3v3 rush or a 4v4 rush as an option, I would even suggest just refreshing your battles just so you can get more rush games and just grind those out as fast as possible. Um, it's still going to be fast if you don't do the rush game mode, but it's probably just a little bit faster um, just doing the rush game mode because there's no goalie and you can just score five as soon as possible and go on to the next one. But as you can see here, Mbappe and Nelly pretty much just 2v3 them and 1-5-0 and then I get one skill point after this game you'll see I'm pretty sure this is my second to last game that I unlock skill points and then the next game that I'm about to show you guys is the last game that I unlock skill points and that is when it gives you three skill points so that's when you know that you're gonna be at max skill points is when it gives you three um so let's see here we go loading screen and there's the one skill point guys and now we're gonna move on to this next game I'm not gonna show you the whole game it's pretty I'm pretty sure it's just the last goal this one I wasn't playing but they passed to me on the kickoff and I literally just took a touch and then scored it's that easy because they're on beginner obviously um, y'all might think this is a little cheap I guess <laughs> but hey, if you want to get your guy upgraded this is definitely the way to do it it's just so easy 
Um, and you can get through the games just extremely fast, faster than you would do any you can any other way. Um, so here we go, Nelly's balling out, and she gets the little final play, and then the, here comes the loading screen, it's about to pop up, and I'll show you guys the three skill points that you get, and that would add up to 75 for the last skill points that you unlock. Here we go. Boom, there it is right there, three skill points. And that means I was pretty, I'm pretty much maxed. And that's about it, guys. That's pretty much all I did. Um, was do that, either just grind on myself and just get the games with, uh, d done with the games as fast as possible, or just let a computer play. Alright guys, that's about it for the video today. Um, I just wanted to show you guys my little method to ranking up your avatar as fast as possible in Volta and getting those max 75 skill points. If you liked the video and you think it was a good source of information and you think it's very it was a useful video, um, please hit a like on the video. I would really appreciate that. And I would also appreciate if you hit the subscribe button on my channel. I will be posting more Volta content and Pro Clubs content um, to my channel every week. So stay tuned for that. Um, I'm going to be doing a lot of Volta builds and Pro Club builds. I did a lot of Pro Club builds last year in FIFA 20 and it worked out pretty well. So I'm going to be doing the same for FIFA 21. So if you like Volta and Pro Clubs, this is definitely the channel to subscribe to. I'm going to be posting a lot of my builds that I've been using and testing out um, in this game. So thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate you guys staying to the end if you are still here. And um, y'all have a great day. Peace out. Peace out.